it's Monday morning and this is another job. This is another lounge I'm doing. Um, so, quick run through. Ceiling is going pure brilliant white. Then the majority of the walls is going Egyptian cotton. And then on the two recesses, either side of the fireplace, this wallpaper is going on. And then in the centre of the fireplace, on that wall, we've got this colour, which is baby fawn. But what we're going to do, or what the lady has asked me to do, is put this uh, silver glitter, which is designed to actually go in the paint to give it a nice glitter finish. So it'll match the paper. So this should be quite an interesting job. What I'll probably show you is a few bits going on through the job. I'm just checking the ceiling over at the minute um, for any cracks, any lumps. You can see there, there's a bit of plaster come off. That's where there's a screw in the ceiling. I'm also checking around the coving for any cracks. Um, what I'm doing is putting a little hole in the corners and I'm going to put some foam in there to stop the cracks. See the crack there. Now if it was just to put cork or powder filler straight over that, within a couple of months it would just crack again and you'll have the same thing. So put a bit of a hole in there because at the back there's a void and it's all slightly loose. You see a hairline crack going that way. A bit of foam in there and that will make it solid and you won't get the cracks coming back. The ceiling, you'll see little bits like that. And that's an actual lump of plaster that's coming off. And usually behind there is either a nail or a screw. So I'll just have a quick look. There you go. That's a screw, that one in there. So a little bit of PVA on that and put some powder filler over and that'll be sorted. If it was a nail, I'd probably replace it with a screw. We were going to use this baby form, but what we've done is got the paper colour matched and <clears throat> they scan it at the shop. And it's turned out really well. Okay, quick run through on the job, how it's going so far. The ceiling's finished. That's our two coats of brilliant white matte. And the wall has had one coat of its glitter paint. And it's come up really well actually. That's not too bad. So preparation's done for the paper on the two other walls. And the preparation is done on the other three walls, ready for the colour, which I'm about to do now. So the colour that's going on, Egyptian cotton. I'll show you that when it's finished. So that's the emulsion on the walls now. It looks really good. Fireplace has had its two coats with the glitter paint. That's come up really well. It depends what angle you're at it and how much light shining on it, but uh, looks really good. So the window sills are done. That's an oil-based gloss on them because. <clears throat> They were so 
uh, shiny and light glass uh, because they had been done in oil based that I decided to do them again in oil based um, so all I've got left really in the room the radiators and the skirting boards and to put the paper on the wall um, so the radiators are going uh, the radiator paint Ron Seal that's a water based stay white that's good stuff and the skirting boards I'm going to use a water based gloss on them that's a Dulux because they were going yellow behind the TV and the couch the wind seals were okay because they're getting a lot of light alright so the next time I show you the job it'll be finished right that's all finished wallpapers on and all the paintings finished I'll just give you a quick look around the room <laughs> 